I'm Steve for This Week with Cars, and tomorrow I'm going ice racing. I'm going to take my Austin Mini Cooper S, and the last time you saw this car, I was rally crossing it in the dirt. It still needs some cleanup from that event, so I'm hoping that the ice and the snow should clean the car real well, just like it did the Ranger last week. But before I get up there, I need to change to my ice tires and look the car over. On the front of the car, I'm going to run some Nokia 520-10 ice tires. These are made in Finland. I'm choosing this tire for the front because it has more studs than the tires that I'm going to be putting on the rear. I want the rear end of the car to move around just a little bit. On the rear of the car, I'm going to be fitting some separate 520-10 tires. These are made in Austria. And the studs on these tires are only on the outsides of the tires, whereas the tires on the Nokia's alternate from the outside to the inside. This car is powered by a 1275 A-Series engine. This is not the original engine because I do road race this car. This engine is equipped with a single SU side draft carburetor. It's also been upgraded with an alternator and electronic ignition. On the inside, the controls are pretty standard, except that the switches have longer necks on them so that you can use them with gloves on. It does have a removable steering wheel, a cage, and a side net. In the rear, it does have an external kill switch, as well as a fuel cell. There is no sender for this fuel cell, so to check the fuel, I have to take this stick, stick it down into the fuel cell, down through the foam, and then where it's wet, we can see where the fuel level is. So it looks like I have about a gallon and a half of fuel left. I made it up here, but the Mini is not liking the five degrees Fahrenheit weather, so I have it hooked up to my truck to try to jump start it.
this here last night, so we had fresh powder when we got here. Now it's getting a little sloshy. The mini's not getting around as well. So I think I will just call it a day. But I had a lot of fun out here. The mini actually, when it was on course, performed great. If you want to see more videos like this, comment below and click subscribe.